About a year and a half ago, when I was out riding my bike every day, it's I think the summer of 2023, but I felt impressed to memorize Psalm 91. And so I would begin to put it to memory. And I know that I can go read it out of my Bible. I know that I can look at the app on my phone. I know that I can look on my computer. I know I can look at my iPad. There are so many places where the Bible is accessible to me and to all of us, but there's something really special about being able to have it downloaded in your heart. So while you're riding your bike, you can begin to confess it out of your mouth or at any given time, you feel like you need the protection of the Lord. And I guess that's what's on my heart is being able to know that God has given us a weapon that we can use you can hear construction going on outside the church right now. We're building that new addition and so, but God can give us arsenal to protect us from the schemes of the enemy. Psalm 91 is this, and this is how I pray it. I dwell in the secret place of the Most High. I abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I say of you, Lord, you are my refuge and my fortress. My God in you I trust. Surely you will deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. You cover me with your feathers and under your wings, I take refuge. Your truth is my shield and buckler. I will not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day, nor of the pestilence that walks in darkness, nor of destruction that lays waste at noonday. A thousand can fall at my side and 10,000 at my right hand, but it shall not come near me. Only with my eyes do I look and see the reward of the wicked. Because I've made the Lord who's my refuge, even the most high my dwelling place, no evil will befall me, nor will any plague come near my dwelling. For he's given his angels charge over me to keep me in all my ways. They'll bear me up in their hands, lest I dash my foot against a stone. I'll tread upon the lion and the cobra, the young lion and the serpent, I will trample underfoot. And then God's response is because I've set my love upon him, he will deliver me. He'll set me on high because I've known his name. When I call upon him, he will answer me. He'll be with me in trouble. He'll deliver me and honor me. And with long life, he satisfies me and shows me his salvation. God bless you.